right, about five minutes ago. Eight, ten. In the morning, Lasha shows up the day after they left at 3.30. They said, we can check in at 3.30. I said I was going to the restroom at the sheriff's, or sorry, at the police department. I went and proceeded to talk to a detective for two minutes to get a phone number for the real estate fraud department for my case, because coming back here would be a pain in the ass. My cat, outside the building somewhere, lost as I left the building from the bathroom after having diarrhea from the fucking taco that Officer Alta Marino gave me, and he joked about how he can't handle that food because it makes him sick after he gave it to me. I take a one minute detour to walk through the garden of the front entrance to the back wall where the parking lot begins and on the sidewalk back towards my camp across the street at the library. At which point they had left and had abandoned. It was 3.31 and 48 seconds. I noted this on my watch and on my computer. I got inside the tent and began cleaning as soon as I got in to be able to leave because my wife and I were going to go together and she had not yet returned. I was only noted at 3.15, 3.10, that at 3.30 I could check in and that I had a room. However, I had been waiting Monday, Sunday, Saturday, Friday, Thursday, Wednesday, Tuesday, Monday night at the beginning of a rainstorm, I was dumped in front of the Hollenbeck Police Department without a blanket or a tent or any clothes at all. I survived in the rain. After three days, we acquired a tent on our own by going to the backside of the Mariachi Plaza and asking and begging for one from someone else, not a program. We're routinely harassed by every officer except for Alfred Moreno, who, in a semi-charming, but still curt way, violates our rights with 4118 in positions that are constitutional, unethical, and downright shit. Anyway, today, 8 20, 8, 15. In the morning, 8, 10 in the morning, Lisa, I think her name is, from Lasha, comes and says, what happened to you? You were gone. And actually, the actual truth is, you were gone. I was here. You said check-in was at 3.30, not leaving was at 3.30. Lisa Pacheco, 213. 276-0476 L Pacheco at Lasha dot org L-A-H-S-A That's L P-A-C-H-E-C-O at Lasha dot org Homeless Engagement Team Member Access and Engagement Well, I'm sure Dave or Jerry Kush will think it's so excellent the way you handled this sensitive experience because upon you stating what you said I said you left at 331 I said my wife hasn't returned yet and you said we were here and I said no you were you were not here you left at 331 I was here at 331 and 35 seconds I saw you drive away I waved at you actually said where I was, told you where I was in advance. Then, as I attempted to tell you that my wife is missing, you tried to cover up your bullshit. As I told you my wife was missing again, you said, what, I can't hear you. As I told you my wife was missing again, you said, so you're refusing service to go to the hotel. I said, no, actually, no, not at all. I want to go. You said, so, I don't know if we'll be able to keep it. And then you walked away. You didn't say, where's your wife? You didn't say, oh my God, it's been 36 hours. You didn't say, 
I didn't see her when I drove and looked for her the other day, which that would have been nice to know, confirm or deny whether or not you saw her when you told me you were going to look for her. Because that doesn't mean anything that you didn't return with her. What it says to me is that you're an insensitive, absolute fucking asshole who doesn't give a shit about human beings, who doesn't think to ask such a sensitive question, who doesn't seem to understand the relevance of how important a loved one is to another loved one, who is homeless, displaced, and missing their cat and wife. And why are we so important to remove from here? Because we're at the base of a Christmas tree next to CD14, across from Hollenbeck. They don't want it at the fucking council office next to it in front of a library that's about to have its re-grand opening on Monday, which is still Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday. Six fucking days away. They're worried about us being baby Jesus in the manger at the base of the palm tree, pine tree that is at first and Hollenbeck Station and the District Council Office of, six, of District 14, Kevin DeLeon. Oh, we asked them to leave the plug on overnight at the library. They said we can't because it's controlled by CD14 the council office, even though the plug goes into the library, it's run by the council district. What dicks? They don't actually want us to get help. Lasha fails repeatedly. That's what Arthur Moreno will say. He said people will dumped on his doorstep. None of the services fell, followed through. They finally get us a fucking place to check into. Do we even need them to check us in? Could they just tell me the fucking name of the address of the fucking place that we have as a hotel temporary voucher? What the fuck? Tell me where to go so I can go check myself in. That's what happens with a voucher. They don't even tell me that. So I tell you. Fuck Lisa Pacheco. Fuck that bitch.